Okay students, we are in Google Earth and we're going to use Google Earth to explore um, some totem poles. And so we're going to start at our school. And so up here in the um, search bar, I'm going to type our school's name, Nathaniel Green Elementary. You can see I've been there before and click on it. And then we're going to zoom to Nathaniel Green Elementary when I click the little uh, magnifying search glass. And here we go. We're going into North Carolina. And now we are at Nathaniel Green Elementary. And there's the art room, and there's the dairy next door, and we can see all kinds of fun stuff. So we want to go visit totem poles, and the totem poles that we're going to go visit are in a town in Canada called Duncan. And so I've already loaded it there, and we are going to go look at the totem poles in Duncan, Canada. And that's the Pacific Northwest. Here we go. So now we're in Canada. We flew over the United States, and this is the town of Duncan. Aerial view. Aerial means you're up above looking down. And I'm going to go over here to this side, and there's a little person. When I, when I roll my cursor around, a little person pops up. And I'm going to take that person, and I'm going to drag it over to here, because I want to see street view. And that will take me to street view. And there's Duncan Canada street view. How cool is that? And the thing I love about um, this little town is they have a walking tour where you can see all kinds of totem poles. So if you look right here, you can see there's some totem poles already. Um, there's one with a thunder, uh, looks like a thunderbird, and I'm not 100% sure what that one is. And we've got a few other totem poles over here. That one up there might be an eagle. And let's see if we can find some more. Like I said, the whole town is just full of them, and if you ever visit Duncan, you can take a little tour of it. So I'm just taking my cursor and pulling it around to change my view. And then if I click on this little white arrow, that's a little walking arrow. And you have to do it a few times. And I see a couple totem poles up ahead. I wonder if you can see them too. So I see one right over here and another one with some color over there. And if you want to look closer, you can stop and drag it around. This one looks like it has some type of a bird on top and a person on the bottom. And here's another one over there. Looks like it has a bird on top as well. I'm not sure. That might be a bear with a, a fish in its hand. Now let's see what else we can see. Here's another one. Very colorful. I like how they have some paint on it, but at the same time you can still see the wood. Very abstract. Remember abstract means it doesn't look 100% real. Sometimes you can still tell what it is though. There's a really pretty one up here. Let me go a little bit further. And there's a really pretty one right here. You can see it. It's like another Thunderbird. Oh. <laughs> and I don't know if you can tell. Let me go a little closer here. But the bottom of that one, right here, that's like a orca or killer whale. Isn't that neat? And then across here you have a couple other ones. And there's more, Duncan. They have them all over the place. So if you want to leave Street View, you just go up to where it says Exit Street View. And that will pop you back up into your aerial view. And then if you want to go further away, you just hit the minus sign. And you're flying away from the Earth and up above and into the atmosphere. I do want to show you one other thing actually a couple of other things um, using Google Earth. So our Earth is a bit topsy-turvy right now because when we were walking around in downtown Duncan, um, north kind of went to the side. This little button here is north. So to ride it, you just have to drag north back up that way. Okay, drag it back up to the top. There we go. Um, and this is the area where you would find totem poles. So we live way over here in North Carolina. And in this area of the United States and into Canada, this is all Canada right here. And then if you go up even a little bit higher, um, this line, this little yellow line, that's where Alaska starts. So up into Alaska and Canada is where you would find the totem poles that we're learning about. And that part of our country is called the Pacific Northwest. Northwest, because this is our country, it's north and to the west. The west is this way. The east is over here. We live on the east part. But Pacific Northwest, because this is the Pacific Ocean, and it butts up against the Pacific Ocean. So that is where you would find totem poles. And if you wanted to go back home from where you would find totem poles, you can go back to Nathaniel Green one more time just to complete our round trip. 
we'll be back at the art room before you know it. There you go. So I hope you have an opportunity to play around with Google Earth. It's super fun and you can learn so much. Explore it one day.